right? Yesterday we spoke about how it's important to um, place warm water, a warm water towel on them and to squeeze them and, and, and to help hand pump them to get out uh, whatever old milk or whatever was in there. And not only are we getting the, the milk, the old milk coming out, there's pus coming out through there as well and a little bit of blood. All right, which this is good. You want to get this out. The more pus and leftover bad milk and all that that you get out of her, the better she's going to feel. And the better she feels, the quicker she's going to recover. All right. Her eating, she's eating a little bit better today, this morning. She ate yesterday. She picked. She didn't really eat with a whole heap of appetite. But she did eat, and that's the good thing. Okay, we added a little bit of soft uh, food with the kibble to help her eat. And she did eat a little bit. She did eat this morning as well. So we're good. Now in a little bit, we'll give her antibiotic again. This will be the third day for the antibiotic of penicillin. And she should be good to go. But we will um, document the process with her so you guys can see. And um, hopefully help your dog one day or help somebody's dog that uh, needs some help with this. You okay, girl? You're all right, baby. Don't worry. Mommy and Papa's here. This was a other. This was another um, nipple that we've been working on. That first one, I did another video, which I'm going to show on Instagram. It was just oozing, oozing pus. And this one, we just started working on. But in the beginning, what they'll do is they won't come out a lot. It, you have to warm it up, hit the water, get it going. And then once it gets all going and opens up good, it'll start leaking out a nice amount of pus, blood, slash leftover milk. But you have to get it going. And the whole thing here is to get as much as that stuff out every day or every couple of hours. Try to get as much out. Because like how I said, the more of that you get out, the quicker your dog's going to recover. Antibiotic is key. Don't forget the antibiotic is key. Without the antibiotic, you're not gonna probably get to the stage. Your dog will just probably stop eating, stop drinking, and pass away on you. And that's the last thing you want. And if your puppies are too small, well, there goes your puppies as well. So, don't take this lightly, mastitis. Don't take mastitis lightly. When you see your dog's um, breast slash nipple swell up, make a move quick. Contact your vet, Let ask him. Um, to see if you can bring the dog in and let them know or if you feel that you do have mastitis and you're too far from a vet um, Go get yourself some penicillin and, and do what we're doing right here Because this will definitely save your dog And if you don't do this You can run into some serious problems quick I hope you enjoyed the video If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to hit the like button That helps us grow, that helps us get to other dogs to help other dogs all right, guys, much love. Everyone have a beautiful day.